Okay, ladies and gentlemen, today what I want to share with you is a very cool way of adding a shortcut from a URL to your homepage on your iDevice. Okay, this is particularly being done today on an iPhone 6 Plus. So, what I want to share with you is how to do this, and this is uh, going to take some steps, a few steps, but I want to show you how it works. I have my iPhone plugged in here and I'm going to switch over to the Safari application. Very simple. Home. Message. Doc. Mail. 500. Mail. 500. Messages. Six. Mail. Safari. Alright, so there's Safari. I'm going to double tap on it. Safari. Address. 30%. Reader available. Safari. Homemaintenance.com. Heading level 1. Link. Banner. Right, Landmark. So let's check what we've got here. I've been dealing with carpal tunnel syndrome, CTS, and rest tendonitis, tennis nevitis, on and off. Alright, I've got this page where I've been doing research in for a friend of mine about carpal tunnel syndrome, and I want to share with you quickly how to add a shortcut of this link here on this page to your iOS device homepage. So down at the bottom here we have buttons. One of them is uh, labeled share. I believe this button was... Um, introduce an iOS 9 and above. So I'm using iOS 9.2 for any of those the, of you that want to know. Here is the share button. Share button. And the share button is right next to the home button. I would say upper left hand corner there. But if you do a single finger swipe or flick, then you can find the button. But I'm going to illustrate that. Let me left flick here. Forward end button. Okay, I'm going to right flick. Share button. And then I'm going to double tap on share so I can show you how to share this. Alert. Airdrop recipient. No one found yet. Image. Now you're going to find some options here. The option that we're looking for is, you'll see as we go through each option. Airdrop. Share instantly with message button. Draggable. Message. Mail button. Draggable. Mail. Reminders button. Draggable. Reminders. Notes button. Draggable. Notes. Facebook button. Drag. WhatsApp button. Dra Twitter button. Dra Save PDF to iBooks button. Telegram button. More button. Copy button. Print button. Add to favorites button. Add bookmark button. Add to reading list button. Add to home screen button. Draggable. That's the one that we're looking for. Add to home screen. Notice that you have several options that you can choose, but this is the one that we're looking for. We're going to double tap here. Selected. Add to home screen. Draggable. Add to home. Text field. Is editing. Character mode. Carpal tunnel syndrome treatment for relief, recovery, and prevention. Insertion point at end. Now, here's the deal. Here, you can type in whatever you want. This is a text field, but I'm going to leave as this. And since I already know where this button is, I'm going to left flick with my finger, and I'm going to find the add button. But in this text field, you can type in whatever you want. Let me left flick here. Add button. That's the add button. That means that this particular shortcut is going to be added to my home screen. Let me double tap. Home, messages, rent.com. Okay, so I am at the screen where this shortcut was just added, and I'm going to go and tap on the bottom left-hand corner of the screen. Doc, phone, 139 new items. Okay, then I'm going to flick left. Page 404, adjustable. Notice that I'm on the fourth page, then I'm going to flick left again. Carpal tunnel syndrome treatment for relief, recovery, and prevention. So I'm going to double tap on that just to test it. Safari, address, 31%, reader available. So just to verify, I'm going to look at the page. Carpal tunnel syndrome treatment for relief, recovery, and prevention, heading level 2. That's it, and that is your way of actually adding a shortcut from a link into your homepage. Now remember that that shortcut can be moved anywhere. You know, in this case, it was added to the last screen, but that's pretty much how it works. If you have any questions, you can email me at blindtechchannel at gmail.com. That is blind, T-E-C-H, channel at gmail.com. And uh, make your requests. And I usually post these tutorials within a day or two of being requested. Thank you. Have a nice day.